Hello, my country people. Welcome back to the news, guys. A lot of Nigerians are putting pressure on uh, Dangote, one of the richest men in Africa, to reduce his uh, price of uh, cement. Yes, you know, uh, Bois Cement tweeted that they would reduce their price to 3500 they made it known. The management of Bois Cement said they will reduce their price to 3500 And they said that the new price will become effective from October 2nd. And the company said it would monitor field sales to ensure compliance among the firm's uh, licensed dealers so that even those at the grassroots, including wholesalers and retailers of this Boa cement, they would also adhere to this new price. Because, you know, say some people, if company don't just say they go they sell 3 5 other people feel they say, well, now company talk up. Then feel they sell 5000 as they, they said before. But the company have said they would ensure, even at the field level, he has promised to reduce, the owner of Boa Cement has promised to reduce the price of cement bags from about 5500 to the range of 35. Once the company increased its production capacity to 17 million uh, metric tons per annum. And they are starting this by October. It will commence by October. So my country people, this is it all. When Boa Cement made this uh, you know, declaration. Uh -uh. People were now saying, wow, how about uh, Dangote? Won't Dangote follow suit? Or won't this cause, uh, you know, a, a, a backward uh, sales for Dangote? Because trust Nigerians now. If Boasment is selling for 3500 surely a lot of people will go for Boasment. A lot of people will go for it and abandon uh, Dangote. So it would be bad business for him if he continues to sell his own for 5500 or 5000 Depends on how he wants to sell. So people now have been, you know, calling to the attention of uh, Dangote to do something about this. So uh, Nigerians have been calling out to the Africa's richest man, Aliko Dangote, who is the also the president of the Pan-African, you know, Kogo Mirit the Dangote group, to emulate his fellow businessman, Sadima Rab uh, Rabiu, and reduce the price of cement to 3500 pay back, you know, because as a gesture of goodwill, the management of Boa Cement, founded by Rab Rabiu, who is also the chairman of the Boa Group, a Nigerian you know, businessman who concentrates on manufacturing cement had made an announcement on the reduction of the X factory cement price to 3500 per bag, which he said will be effective for Monday, uh, October 2nd, 2020, you know, three. And uh, in a statement that the Boa Group published on his X account, the company said that the gesture was in keeping with its previous promise to reduce the price of, of cement upon the completion of the new lines at the end of the year in order to smart development in the building materials and infrastructure sectors. So, several reporters have reported that Boa Cement did not stop at splashing the price of cement. It also promised that all pending undelivered orders which had been paid for at the old prices would be reviewed downwards to 3,500 pay back in line with the new pricing from October uh, 2nd, 2023. So, all licensed dealers are also enjoined to ensure that the end users benefit from this reduction in the X factory prices. And they will also monitor field sales to ensure compliance because trust some Nigerians, some people can be very greedy and very selfish. Even when the company has made you know, this very wonderful declaration that they would splash uh, the, the cement price from 5500 to 35 pay back. Some wholesalers, some dealers, 
some licensed dealers would want to sell at the rate of you know five thousand era some dealers would want to do that but you see the price of well, uh, the price of cement i beg your pardon across nigeria rose to five thousand and above which tremendously increased the cost of building houses amid the current economic crunch ravaging the country with the devaluation of the naira that we are facing and the full subsidy removal. However, Nigerians have been calling out Dangote, asking him to show that yes, he loves Nigeria. By emulating his competitor, Bois Cement, he should emulate this man and reduce the price of you know, his own cement, which is Dangote cement, to 3,500 per bag. So my country people, Nigerians have reacted. I mean, Dangote has more wealth and can as, can as well, you know, emulate this gesture of Bois Cement com group of company. And this is for the first time, you know, a comp any competitor is doing something like this. And uh, a lot of people are saying we must stamp monopoly of any kind because this is huge. And we must appreciate the patriot, Mr. Abdul Salam Rabiu. This is the first time that this is happening without the intent of killing any competitor. Like it has been the practice of other cement giants. We must stamp monopoly of any kind. People are saying Dangote should do the same. Well, you don't need Dangote to do the same. Just start buying Bois cement. Businesses that care about the masses are worth supporting. That is my point. Good one. We are waiting for Dangote and, Ele and the elephant cement to follow suit. The difference between the, this billionaire businessman, Boa and the Dangote, is that one of them has empathy, while the other one swiftly debunked the news that his company price was splashed. Meanwhile, the Dangote group on September 25th had denied claims that it would reduce the price of cement to... Uh, 2,700 that's per 50 kilogram bag which was selling for 5,500. The spokesperson for Dangote Group, Anthony, said last Monday that the report was fake and uh, it was a fake news and Nigerians should please debunk such report. But then my country people, as it stands now, we are actually waiting for the implementation of this price. Uh, for Bois cement from 5,500 to 3,500. I mean, it is really, uh, this is a, a, a good news. I mean, it shows that Rabiu is a patriotic Nigerian. In the time of this severe economic hardship, the other monopolist increased prices of all his products almost on a daily basis. You know, we are seeing increase in prices of goods and services. But Abdul Salam, uh, Rabiu has his people at heart. He has the interest of the masses at heart. And definitely God will bless him because even if Dangote, uh, Dangote group of company chooses to ignore and uh, continue selling theirs at 5,000 or 5,500 per bag of cement, it doesn't matter. But you know the masses, they would have always go for you know the goods that are lesser that are way more cheaper and has the same quality with that of a Dangote cement. So my country people, I believe with all this, I mean, it would uh, lead to a reduction in cost of building and all of that. So guys, I'm dropping here. What are your thoughts on this? Kindly share your thoughts concerning this in the comment section. Thank you.